quadruple rainbows in the sky. What does it mean? It means it's time for Netlink Daily. At the Reboot Developed 2015 conference in Dubrovnik, Croatia, Assassin's Creed creator Patrice de Soleil revealed a teaser trailer for his new game. The title of the game is called Ancestors The Humankind Odyssey. This new game by his studio, Panache Digital Games, is a third person survival action adventure episodic game. Each episode will have the player relive some of the greatest moments in human history with a documentary twist. More info is to come later on this year, but early speculation from commenters say that it's an Assassin's Creed game without the assassins or the creed. Researchers from FireEye, a security firm, have discovered a flaw in the fingerprint scanner of the Galaxy S5 and other unnamed Android phones. The flaw allows hackers to steal fingerprint data from the fingerprint scanner itself before it can reach the designated secured biometric storage area. Most phones need user level access to get this info, however with the S5, only system level access is needed. Obviously, this is bad news for payment apps like PayPal that now only need a fingerprint to pay for things. The good news is, if you upgrade to the 5.0 Lollipop, the flaw no longer works. Looks like I'll be sticking to my 27 digit passcode instead of my fingerprint. Or thumbprint in this case. Valve is now allowing mods to be sold in the Steam Workshop. Valve's Tom Bowie says user generated content is an increasingly significant component of many games, and opening new avenues to help financially support those contributors via Steam Workshop will help drive the level of user generated content to new heights. Skyrim has already 19 paid mods ranging from 30 cents to just a little over $7. Valve does have a 24 hour time limit on mods where you can get a refund to your Steam wallet if for some reason you don't like the mod. But come on, let's be real. Who wouldn't want the Blaze Ring Sword for 30 cents? That's a good deer. And it's time for something a little different. Do -do 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 -do! Lightning bits. Samsung's next smartwatch has been confirmed to have a round screen. G-Skills Ripjaws 4 128GB kit is the world's fastest RAM at 2800MHz. Yahoo is looking to make its own version of Google now. Samsung's Gear VR is up for pre-order tomorrow, April 24th. NASA's Next SS Coalition wants to search for life on other planets. And a company called Most Case has designed an iPhone 6 case with modular attachments. Attachments like a breathalyzer, solar charger, speakers, and more. Check them out on Kickstarter. Hagelschlag. That's Dutch for sprinkles. Thank you Legend Heed from r slash PC Master Race. This week is NCIX's April Showers event because April showers bring May flowers. The Canadian deal this week is an LG 55 inch 4K IPS TV for $12.99. That's a savings of $400 plus you get an additional $200 gift card from NCIX. Wow. The American deal is the ASUS ROG G750JZ gaming laptop for $16.99. That's a savings of $600 and both deals qualify for free shipping Holy cow! Click here or down in the description for all the details. Alright, that's it for Netlink Daily. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this from NCIX. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go find some sliced bread and some butter to try out this uh, box of Hagelschlag. To the Jackmobile! <laughs>